Hello friends, this is Adam with Movie Guy 365 and it is new release Tuesday for July 23rd, 2019. We have quite a few things coming out this week. We have the big one, Alita Battle Angel, is coming out also with a couple of exclusives over at Best Buy and Target. I'm not sure if Walmart has it. Uh, it's also available in a Blu-ray slash 3D slash 4K combo pack. I'm very excited to check that out. Also new this week is the 2019 Hellboy reboot, which actually has a really nice looking steelbook cover. We're going to check that out over at Best Buy. Also, Oliver Stone's The Doors is getting the 4K treatment, so that's going to be out there in the wild. And Laka's animated film, uh, Missing Link, is also available. We're going to go check that out at the usual places. Speaking of the usual places, join me today as we hit Target, Best Buy, and Walmart. We're going to check out all the exclusives, everything out new this week for Blu-ray and 4K. And yes, in the meantime, please like, subscribe, hit that bell notification, and put out videos every single day. So let's head on out today and see what we can find. I'm sorry, Target does have their exclusive. Uh, it's the Blu-ray 3D. When was the last time you saw 3D in any Target? Uh, their combo pack 4K. It also comes with a USB charger. And it's so listed as $32.99. Standard 4K is $29.99. It's a nice cover there. And also the standard Blu-ray has no 4K, just uh, I don't even know if they have a 3D here. No, it's just Blu-ray DVD. Uh, $22.99 for that. And your standard Blu-ray. Also, we have David Harbour's Hellboy, 4K edition. And they also have a Steelbook Blu-ray only. Well, for $24.99. It's a shame, because I kind of like this one, but if it was 4K, I might consider it. Of course, standard Blu-ray edition. And they also have Critter's Attack. Made that for $19.99, I believe. And they do have Missing Link over here. $19.99. But that's no exclusives that I'm aware of. Uh, we'll check Walmart. I'm certain Best Buy doesn't have one. Yeah, let's just see what else they got. Anything for sale? Yeah, there's just some random stuff here and there. Some 4K offerings here. Doesn't look like they have a whole lot of sales going on this week as far as catalog stuff, so. Yeah, don't really see. Good to see Target having everything out today, so. All right, let's head on over to Walmart. Hopefully they have their stuff out this week. As I mentioned, I don't think we have any exclusives for Leo over there, but you never know. Maybe probably knowing them it's a Funko Pop or something. So, all right, we're gonna head over to check them out and then we'll hit Best Buy, so. All right, see you over at Walmart. All right, Walmart, hopefully you have your stuff out for us today. Ah, called it. Funko Pop. $22.96 for the Alita gift set here. $29.96 for the 4K edition. Uh, Blu-ray is $19.96. You do have standard DVD. I don't see any DVD exclusive. Uh, Hellboy copies. I don't see an exclusive there. And then for $17.96 for the Blu-ray. $19.96 for the 4K. I guess that's a exclusive as a digital graphic novel included. Uh, and they do have Critters Attack here. They have that for $19.96. Missing link here, 1996 for that. Let's see. Hmm. I thought for sure they would have the doors here in 4K. Usually Walmart's very good at the catalog 4K stuff. So it doesn't look like we're in luck for that one. Maybe they'll have it at Best Buy. And of course, then we have our, you know, just our stuff from previous weeks. And just some random stuff here and there. All right, Best Buy, show 
Jones. That's your luck. All right, so we do have the Blu-ray copy of Hellboy 2019 for 19.99. Give you a shot at the back. And let's see, the 4K edition, $24.99. And a couple of Steelbook stall stock. That is $29.99 for the 4K Steelbook. Critters Attack also comes out this week. <laughs> oh man, Critters. It's been a minute. Let's see here. Let's see if we can find the Alita. Ah, here we go. So they do have a standard 4K edition, but now this, remember, this also includes the 3D and the 4K, and as well as the Blu-ray. But I don't see the Steelbook, but I did have mine for in-store pickups, so I can show that to you, no problem if we don't find it in the back. So, all right, missing link here, $19.99 for that one. I'm anxious to check this one out, honestly. It just, I feel, was marketed really, really poorly, but it's from the same makers of Kubo and the Two Strings, and that was a great film. But yeah, let's do it. well, just the standard slip cover. All right, let's head in the back, see what we can find. Yeah, so no steel books here either. Um, I guess this is it new this week, Manifest, the complete first season. Let's see here, some more Alitas. There doesn't seem to be a whole lot of stock, so I probably wouldn't wait too long if you were interested in this movie release week, because it might start selling out. Yeah, don't see any Wayward Steelbooks laying around. Like I said, I do have one in-store pickup, so I'll show it to you guys in a minute. So they do have a standee here, but just like the other sections, they don't have any steel books for Lita. And it's Shazam from last week. Just a couple of random sales here and there. Uh, usual suspects, you know, like these the Universal, some of the Universal films are on sale this week. And of course some of the Fox films also. Nothing outstanding as far as the sale goes. Yeah, so that's pretty much going to do it for this week's shopping video. It was nice that everybody had everything out today. I didn't want to go looking for anything. It was a bit unfortunate. We didn't see a 4K copy of the doors anywhere. Uh, I thought for sure Walmart would have it. They typically go for those sort of weird catalog titles in a 4K section. Also, nothing at Best Buy. That was very strange. It might be one of those things where it shows up like later in the week. I, sometimes that does happen. I wouldn't be surprised if I went in next week and there's like 20 copies of the doors in 4K. Uh, but I did pick up, man, uh, managed to pick up uh, Missing Link. I picked that one up. I um, didn't get a chance to see that one in the theater, but I'm anxious to check it out because I'm a fan of Kubo and the Two Strings and Laka. I mean, they, they have a good studio there. I think this movie was just poorly marketed. Also, I did pick up, as promised, the Steelbook 4K exclusive with 3D of Alita Battle Angel. And there's the back right there. I'm anxious anxious to get my hands on this one just from a i saw it in theater i actually saw this one in dolby cinema 3d it was an experience it really was it was it was a beautifully made film i can't wait to check it out at home in both 4k and 3d i'm of course going to be reviewing this one i'm going to be reviewing all my pickups this week and mm, against my better judgment i went for the steelbook of hellboy 2019 not a great movie but i am anxious to check out the 4k and the dolby vision on this one I bet it's going to be something nice. Hopefully it helps out with some of the CGI shots that look a little bit dodgy in the theater. And of course I do have a copy of the four, uh, I'm sorry, the Doors 4K coming in from Amazon. I'm glad I ordered it from those guys because if I was relying on it to find it in the wild, I'd be way out of luck. Um, but yeah, so that's pretty much going to be all my pickouts. I am of course going to be doing reviews for all of these. So stay tuned to the channel for those reviews this week. And next week we don't have a whole lot. We do have the Seth Rogen, Charlize Theron comedy long shot which I really really enjoyed that one and unfortunately it's only a blu-ray you can get a, a 4k copy digitally as well as um, 
Let's see what else. Uh, Glory in 4K is also coming out next week. I'm very excited about that one. That's one of my favorite wartime movies. I'm just a massive fan of anything having to do with the Civil War. I just I love films like that, and I love this movie. It is. I mean, it's not an easy movie to watch, but you know Sony behind this one in 4K. It's, it should look really really nice. I can't wait. So let me know in the comments below what did you guys pick up this week. Let me know, and in the meantime, please like and subscribe. Hit that bell notification. I put out videos every single day. So until next time, this is Adam with Movie Guy 365. I will see you at the movies.